YouTube. What's up, baby? <laughs> What's going on, everybody? What's going on? Um, today, we're going to talk about selling dreams, okay? We're going to talk about selling dreams. I think that's going to be the title of the video. Is that what it says? Oh, down there. Uh, there, whatever. But, um, you know, I get a emails and um, questions. Well, of course, that's what emails are, but questions. And you get some comments and you talk to other Stevens drivers. And um, a lot of them say, not a lot, but it's a lot of, I just said not a lot, but some of them say I'm selling dreams. So, you know, after a couple of times, you, bruh, I'm out here living, man, blah, 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 right? But once you get it a couple of more times, you're like, you take a step back and you just look at your videos and, you know, some of the stuff that you talk about, the stuff that you post. And you know what? I have been selling dreams. I have. And I should be ashamed of myself. Mm-hmm. Uh, the reason... I should be ashamed of myself. And then, you know, I, I was looking, because if you look at my videos, especially on YouTube, you look at my videos, I seem like a happy guy. I seem like I'm enjoying myself out here on the road. I seem like Steve is just taking real good care of me, don't I? The truth is, that's the truth. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, am I really selling dreams? But again, you gotta, you gotta take a step back. You gotta see what everybody else see. Yeah, yeah, I'm selling dreams. I, I'm selling hella dreams, okay? Now, the reason I'm, I, I say that is because I don't know the people that watch my videos or people that think about coming to Stevens or I don't know if you're willing to do the things that I do. You know, and you know, uh, I think who was it? Um, I forgot your name, bro. My bad. I should have read the email. I didn't think I was gonna say your name, but you know, he was he was like, uh, he sent me an email and said, I know you can't say everything you want to say on your videos because Stevens is watching. I don't even know if Stevens watching. This Stevens ain't got nothing to do with my page. Um, they don't pay me for this. This is out of the kindness of my heart to to pass on the knowledge the experience, the stuff that I learned and pass it on to you guys in my videos. Um, you know, they have nothing to do with this. Uh, one of the reasons I haven't monetized my, my channel yet is because, you know, I just, for me, it's not really about that. You know, and I know, man, you stupid, man, you doing this for free where you can get, get paid. I, I'm gonna monetize one day. That's just not a priority for me. It is, but it's like, you know how you got your list? The list is that you know monetizing my YouTube is like down here somewhere. You know what I'm saying? And uh, that's just why I haven't done it yet. But I just want to make I want to I want my channel to be as pure, as honest, and as straightforward, I guess, as possible. And I'm guessing I can't be that straightforward because I be joking all the time because that's what people be saying. But who cares? Just take the overall take the overall of my videos, the happiness, the, the comp, I don't be calm in my videos, do I? No, but the happiness, let's just take that. Doing what I want to do, taking care of family, and enjoying my trucking career. Now, with that being said, I have a secret weapon, okay? The reason I'm being successful, the reason I am successful, I have a secret weapon. I haven't really talked about it a lot, but this secret weapon is the reason I'm successful at Stevens, okay? Now, everybody might not have this secret weapon, so your experience might not be the same as mine, okay? And my secret weapon is my wife. And, you know, the thing, the sacrifices we made, the sacrifices she's made for us to be able to be in the position that we're in right now, that's my secret weapon, man. Without her, <laughs> I, I, it wouldn't be possible. I mean, the things that we have to do to make sure that we get to where we want to get to and for her to be on board and to be with me and support me, it makes it that much easier to be out here. You know what I'm saying? So that's my secret weapon. So if you ain't got one of those, 
you might want to go find you one. But anyway, you know, selling dreams. That's what we're talking about, right? How much time I got? Okay, selling dreams. Um, you know, like I said, I watch my videos and like taking a step back, looking at it as a viewer and not as myself. I can see where people would say that. Because, I mean, it's almost like I have nothing negative to say about Stevens. You know, the, the negative stuff that I do say is small. You know, like I was looking for Lowe's to get to Dallas. Um, they hit the, the button about messing your truck up when you become a trainer. You know, uh, I, you know, stuff like that. But <laughs> being out here for the year that I've been out here. You just get to, it's, it's not the companies, man. Your success is you, period. Like when people talk negative about a company, nine times, or they say 9.9 .9 times out of 10, from my experience, it ain't the company, bro, it's them. Cause let's think about what people be saying, okay? You know, once you get a certain, start making a certain amount of money, they look at that and they make sure, like bro, who got time for that? <laughs> who got, we got, 2,000 drivers, bro. We got to move freight. We ain't got time to be worried about how much money this truck made. How much? Who got time for that, man? Like, really think about this, this negative stuff that these people say about these companies, bro. And trucking, and it ain't because I'm a lease operator or owner operator or whatever you want to call operator, glorified company guy. You know, because company is same same thing, man. It's all on you. Okay, let's think. It's Let's think about Stevens when people say they can't make money at Stevens, okay? Let's see how Stevens lie to people. Let's see, let's see if they really do that. Hmm. All right. So when they tell you to come here, my we all know Stevens is a starter company, right? Okay, check. Okay. We all know they pay 30 cent a mile company. Check. Okay, we all know. Am I hold on one second. Am I being too loud? Okay, okay, good. Make sure my man good back there. But we all know what we said, 30 cent. We all know uh, 450 a week and then for the first three weeks and then 500 the next three weeks. So we all know that. Okay, all right. Um, and we all know after 10 months, 75,000 miles, you can become a trainer, company or alliance. And we all know if you want to make big money, you have to become a trainer at Stevens Transport, or you need to be driving for Stevens Transport for at least five to six years without being a company, I mean, without being a trainer. So it's like, when people, man, they, they ain't, like, come on, really? We all, they, they lay it out. Here's how you make good money at Stevens Transport. Go Alliance or company, either one, it's all the same, become a trainer. Now, if you don't wanna become a trainer, be ready to only make anywhere between six to maybe eleven, twelve hundred dollars $1,200 a week as a company guy, starting out. Oh, whoa, I said 1,200, didn't I? Ugh, okay, I, I was selling the dream on that one. Now, Alliance, you could make 1,200, but company, you got to be running to make $1,200 as a first year, guy I don't can y'all see me I hope y'all can see me because the, the sun then got all in the way but um so okay I don't want to be a trainer because I don't want to share my truck hey that's fine okay if you're going to be a company guy as with one year experience you're going to make 30 cent a mile if for some reason you drive 3,000 miles that's $900 before everything is taken out okay so when the recruiter comes and says you can make $900 a week. This is when you as an adult have to say, hmm, he's clearly talking about gross. Okay, so, so far we got to a point where Stevens hasn't lied, okay? Now, you know, people, I well, I didn't go to the school, so I know nothing about the school, but what I do know, on that contract that you sign, or if you do sign it, if you read it, everything is right there. Mr. Adult, Mrs. Adult, Miss Adultist, is that what it, I don't know, you know what I'm saying. So, so far, we have seen, I'm putting, I'm giving you proof, it can't be the company, bruh. It cannot be the company. Now, it's, it's, 
Because I know I'm going to eat. Well, they did this and did that. Bro, those are circumstances. When people tell you that what a company did to them, let me ask about your driving record. Did you hit anything? Did you get any speeding tickets? Did, uh, did you turn down loads? Were you late? Hmm. Because that's, I mean, that's the only way I can see that a company would do something to you. Because in my opinion, because I only can go off my experience, I'm always on time. Uh, they ain't got no problems with me turning down too many loads. I really don't turn down loads. So I don't turn down loads. I go over they send me because I enjoy doing, I enjoy being surprised at where my next destination is. Actually, it's almost like because I've been here a year, I kind of know exactly where I'm going. So it's not really a surprise, but it is a surprise. It feels it feels good. It's, it's a lot of it's, it's, it makes me happy. But anyway, so so far, in my opinion, you got to say my opinion because then it's hard for you to argue my opinion. You know what I'm saying? Um, in my opinion, it's not the company, man. OK, in my opinion, I'm not selling dreams. I'm showing you that it is possible to be successful at Stevens Transport. Now, I don't go in all detail in my videos, but that's what my email is for. Ask me questions. Now, hey, look, <clears throat> it is gonna take me a while to get back to you, okay? Because uh, uh, people be sending me books. I don't have no problem with it, but it's gonna take me some time, okay? I got to read them. I got to, you know, do some calculations in my head, then I respond. So, you know, if you want to get more in detail, and I, I tell you guys a little bit about what I do, I say I call every day. Okay, we're here at the at the um, at the Target. Okay, we got our pre-plan already. I called and made sure my pre-plan is ready. It's ready, so I know as soon as we done here, as soon as we done, we send the loaded and uh, no, the empty at destination jump. We already headed to the next spot. Okay before they even dispatch me. You know, they gonna dispatch me on my way down there. And then by the time we, we know it's ready, so that mean, I know it's a washout there, so I don't need to stop for a washout. I might need to put some fuel in it, depending on how long they take to unload us. That's real quick. We pick that load up, and now we headed to Cali. Then, okay, when I pick that load up, all right, I wanna see, am I gonna be early? Okay, it's a two drop joint, okay, which I really don't like, but hey, make the best of it. Uh, the first delivery is on the 5th, Sunday. Today is the 2nd, Thursday. Okay, if for some reason we can get out of here and get some miles up under our belt today, we will be there Saturday afternoon. I already know that. So guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna call my DM. I'm gonna call uh, the repower dude. And I'm gonna send a Qualcomm message. Hey, we're probably gonna be early on this load. So if anybody needs any help, let me know. I'm, our, I'm putting it out there for the opportunity to keep rolling because I'm going to be early on this load. That's a little snippet right there. Oh, that's so whack. I'm so whack because I'm dropping the song. I'm so whack, dog. This video getting long as hell. So look, okay, I'm not selling dreams. Okay, I'm selling reality. Yes, you can be successful. I'm going to get chat. At Stevens Transport. Period. Okay, if you're not successful at Stevens Transport, it's your fault. I said it. Your fault. Not all, you know, like I said, nine time, 9.9 9 out of 10 is your fault, okay? But you got some situations, blah, 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 blah. But again, I need to know your driving record. I need to know, uh, have you been late? Turning down loads? Any problems? Blah, 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 blah. Before you say that a company did you wrong, okay? So, always ask when person say man this company ain't nothing ask those questions so did you get any tickets did you hit anybody okay were you on time on most of your loads on all your loads okay did you get any speeding tickets did you get any kind of tickets any problems with any shippers receivers okay okay yeah it was the company then because see that's what people don't tell you okay so before you come out here man have an open mind man don't listen to every negative thing people got to say okay just think about that. But if you ain't about that life, you better get out of that truck because this video long as hell. <laughs>